Hey guys, my name is Gleason, and today I'm going to show you how to make a doorbell with the new redstone repeater box. Okay, so first we have to place a button next to the door, at least two blocks away. That, that We'll press this button to make the doorbell sound. Next we need to dig a bit of room for us to actually make the doorbell. Okay, so now we need to place one redstone on the block beneath the button. The button will power this redstone. We need, we also need at least two torches. You can improvise if you want. We need at least two torches between the button and the note blocks. Place another redstone there and a torch there. Now we can start laying the rest of it fairly simple from here. You need one redstone there, which will go to your first note block. You can have either nothing under the note block or dirt to make the harp sound. Otherwise the sound won't be correct. We, now we need we can place our repeater down, make sure with it's the back end of it is touching the torch. So the power will go that way. Now we need at least one redstone between the repeater and the second note block. Remember a gap or dirt be underneath. So now that that will work. If I press the button. We can increase the delay between the note blocks by right clicking the repeater. I like to, I think it's best to have it full full the repeater full. Okay, so now we just need to tune the note blocks. Click the first one. You can change the tune if you want, but I think the best doorbell sound is if you click the first, right click the first note block 16 times. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. And then the second note block 12 times. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Now all we need to do is cover this up. Now we have a working doorbell without doubling your home size or using a lot of redstone. You can put push the button up one and use the same same circuitry, but you'll need like you'll need a more blocks to cover it up, and so it's not obvious and people don't see the circuitry. Thank you for watching this tutorial, and I hope you enjoyed it.